there will be there will be people that will say you can't make a living out of doing something you love to do. But are you really living by not doing it? Okay, so when this project started, um, I noticed very quickly that all of my responses to the question of what brings significance to your life, it all revolved around happiness and working towards something. Working towards a goal that you are going to struggle to achieve. Um, so, I kind of going to open this up and kind of start this off with a bit of a story. When it, kids grow up, they always have this goal of being something like, a fi I want to be a fireman when I grow up. I want to be a policeman or something. Or if you were an entertaining person like me, um, you always said, I wanted to be an actor or something. You wanted to put on some kind of show. And the difference between me and a lot of other people is, well, through some reflection and changing my mind about this a lot, I've kind of just come back to the same goal and the same what I want to do with my life since I was the age of four. And that was professional wrestling. And... Stuff like WWE and all that stuff. What I have grew up to love. Yeah, I know it's not the common answer when people say what they want to do. Especially at the school, because everybody seems like they want to do something important that changes the lives of many. And I want to put on a show for probably not an awful lot of people. Unless I can actually make it all the way to the top. And I think I can. But odds are, as always, very much stacked against you. When it comes to doing something to entertain people. Because you have to be innovative. You have to come up with a show that people can't see anywhere else. Because if they can go anywhere else, they probably will. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm, for the most part, a reasonable human being. I can make decisions that I know at the end of the day is going to leave me better off. So, you're probably thinking why I would still chase something even though I know the odds are stacked against me. It's a million to one. Maybe not a million. But, it's very unlikely for me to be able to succeed like this. And... Entertainment, especially physical entertainment. <laughs> I'm not the biggest guy, I know. But, but it's something I've always wanted to do. It's something that I think I need to. I owe it to myself. I guess I owe it to the four-year-old who walked into his dad's bedroom to see him watching WWE Monday Night Raw. And from then on, was amazed. And that's, at the end of the day, that's what raised me. Well, not raise me. That's what I grew up watching. That's what I grew up loving. Some... Everybody else is sitting at home watching Disney shows with Nickelodeon, and I'm there watching Raw or something. It's just who I was. Sure, that makes me the different kid. But I've always accepted that. I've always loved being the different kid. Because... Authenticity... Nothing's going to make me unique by, except for making choices that people aren't going to. The other reason why I can't give up on this is because one day I'm going to look back on my life and I don't want to ever say that I strongly regret not doing something. I really only have one chance, one life to go for these goals. So I can't just not go for it or else all that's gonna happen is you're gonna end up in a dead-end job just working for a paycheck and at that point you're just living to, to work you're not working to live yes to the right um, <laughs> it's 
all about just at the end of the day walking in and loving what you do because if you don't you're just throwing it all out and you're gonna regret it all I want to do is to walk in every day and say that I love what I'm doing or at least that I know that it's going to be worth it and not just because they're going to pay me because at that point all you're doing is selling away your time you can get money from pretty much anywhere but you're not getting any of that time back you only have a finite amount of minutes to live you, sure you don't know how many but you're not gonna get any more now I know all of this is going to be a struggle there it, until you make it none of it is going to be easy none of it is supposed to be easy and what I want to do there's gonna be a lot of long nights where I'm working for not an awful lot of money probably end up living in my car or something <laughs> pretty much is working show to show but one day it'll be worth it hopefully and I know that I can't back down and I can't run away from any of this because at the end of the day I have to fight for it I have to earn it and there's no way I'm gonna let anybody take it from me when I have a goal I'm going to get it one way or another I'm going to make it mine now at this point you're probably wondering why I would do this to myself why I would put myself through a struggle and the pain and everything well like I said earlier maybe I guess I'm just a little different because because I enjoy the pain I enjoy the struggle for something for me to earn and all the hardships because struggling to get something is how you truly appreciate it I've been given kind of relatively a lot and I'll be the first to admit that I take a lot of that for granted but um you really appreciate something that you earn. To use an example, as like a little kid who's given money, no one cares. <laughs> they'll just spend it because they didn't put any work for it. Now that I've started working, I can I can make money last, and that just that just comes with the fact that I had to put in energy and work to get it, and I don't want to lose it. I've worked too hard for it. Now I guess there's only one last question for me to answer this video. And that's, why me? Like I said, there are probably hundreds of thousands of other people that want to be where I want to get. It's going to take a long time, but who's this to say that they don't deserve it more? And... That's a tough pill to swallow to know that I may, that maybe I'm not the one who deserves it the most. But I'm going to fight to get it. There are billions of other people in this world, but everyone matters if they make themselves matter. And I'm not going to let anybody tell me that I can't make myself matter. I know that in my heart of hearts, that I'm good enough. I can do this. People want to tell me otherwise, that's fine. And I'm going to take that into account by proving them wrong. At the end of the day, I'm going to get there. It's going to take blood, sweat, tears, the whole nine yards. One way or another. I'm accomplishing everything I set out to accomplish. It may sound cliche, but you can 
have anything to dream for. You just have to want it. And I want it. <sighs> Alright. I have saved this video. Wait, make it a small intro. So like, share, comment, subscribe. So begin day.